Hello children, this is Hemalata. Welcome to another session of Mathematics Grade 4. You all would be wondering why Hema ma'am wore apron? Actually, I would like to do some outdoor cooking. Here, I had 25 tomatoes. I used 3 by 5 of the tomatoes to make chutney. How many tomatoes did I use to make chutney? I am a little bit confused. To know this, let us proceed ahead and start learning. Today we are going to learn about solving fraction problems. The aim of this class is we will solve word problems based on fraction. Welcome to our classroom. There are four girls and four boys. What fraction of students are girls? The total number of students is 8. Out of these, 4 are girls. The fraction is 4 by 8. Where 8 is total number of students and 4 is number of girls. We can say 1 by 2 of the students are girls. 4 by 8 is reduced like 4 1's 4, 4 2's 8. Let's do a small action. Seema was sitting side of a pond and counted 16 lotus. She gave 3 by 4 of the lotus to her friend. What fraction of lotus did she give to her friend? Let's have an activity discussion. 3 by 4 of 16 lotus. How did you solve? First, let us arrange the 16 lotus. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Here the denominator is 4. We need to make 4 groups. And all the 16 lotus should be distributed equally among the 4 groups. So let's make 4 groups. 1, 2, 3, 4. So each group got 4 lotus. What fraction of lotus did she give to her friend? 3 by 4. The fraction is 3 by 4. That is, among the 4 groups, she, gave, she decided to give 3 groups of lotus to her friend. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. What are your answers? Yes, she gave 12 lotus to her friend. Let's solve. Richa had 6 slices of bread. She ate 1 by 3 of them. How many slices of bread did she eat? Now, how many slices of bread is, are there? Six. Let's take six slices now. One, two, three, four, five, six. She ate one by three of them. So, what is the denominator here? Three. So, we need to make three groups. One, two, three. 
Among the three groups, how many she had? She ate one by three. That means among the three groups, she ate from one group. Who ate? Richa. So from one group, let us take the bread slices. One, two. So she ate two slices of bread. How many slices? Two slices of bread. Let's have generalized discussion. How do we solve word problems based on fraction? Read the problem carefully. Whenever the problem is given to you, you should first read the problem carefully. Draw picture to understand the problem. After reading, you have to draw picture to understand. Based on the denominator, we need to make groups and distribute pictures equally. Look at the numerator and then count the picture. Higher order thinking. Write a word problem to represent 2 by 3. What word problem did you write? I'm waiting for your word problem. Yes. So, can I write for you? Hema divided a circle shape cut out into three equal parts and colored two parts. What fraction of circle did she color? This is my own word problem. Because what he said, write a word problem to represent two by three. You have to represent two by three. So, I made my own word problem. Like, Hema divided a circle shape cut out into three. Because here the denominator is three. So, I have taken a circle shape and divided into three equal parts. And colored two parts. Here the numerator is two. So, I shaded only two parts. What fraction of the circle did she color? I colored among the three parts. I colored only two parts. Yes. See, this is the circle. I divided into three equal parts. So, the denominator became three and I colored only two parts. So, that is the numerator. Now, the fraction will be two by three. Solving fraction problems. This is your homework. Sara divided a biscuit into two equal pieces. She ate one piece. What fraction of the biscuit did she eat? So one whole biscuit, it is divided into two equal pieces. That is cut into center. She ate one piece. Okay, among the two pieces, she had one piece. So what fraction of biscuit did she eat? Please draw the picture to understand the problem. Second one. Trisha has rupee 30. She spent 1 by 3 of the amount to buy a pen. What was the cost of the pen? Arman has 50 balloons. He blew 2 by 5 of the balloons. How many balloons did he blow? Third question. Write a word problem to find 2 by 5 of 20. You can write your own word problem for this question. I hope you all understood the concept of solving fraction problems. Stay home, stay safe. Thank you.